Hello everyone, my name is Mini Sethi. I hope you all are staying healthy. Today we are going to talk about high powered money and money multiplier. What do you mean by high powered money? High powered money is total amount of money that is actual issued or printed by central bank or government. High powered money is total amount of money that is actual printed or issued by central bank or government. And this is our money base because with the help of this money base, banks create more money in economy. High powered money is equal to C plus RR plus ER. Here H is high powered money. C means currency with public in form of paper money or coins. RR is required reserve. Required reserve means minimum amount of money that bank should keep in reserve. ER is excess reserve. These are additional reserve with bank. So whatever money is issued by a central bank or government, it will be called high powered money or we can say that it will be called our money base. And this money divided into two parts means some part of high powered money goes to bank and some part goes to public. And C is part of high powered money that goes to public because C means currency with public in form of paper money or coins. And this two reserve is part of high powered money which goes to bank. High powered money is our monetary base. With the help of this monetary base, bank expand more money in economy through the process of credit creation. As we know, bank have a power to make more money from money through the process of credit creation. As we know, bank give loans to people and earn so much interest rate. As a result, money supply increase in our economy. Suppose our monetary base is 1 crore. This is actual money that is issued by central bank or government. And with this monetary base, through the process of credit creation, bank has increased total money supply in economy that is equal to 2 crore. So high powered money is our monetary base. With this monetary base, bank expand more money in economy. Eventually money supply increase. So we can say that as high powered money increase, money supply will also increase in economy. Same thing you can see in this diagram. On x axis we have money supply. On y axis we have high powered money. This OH shows demand for high powered money. HS, HS1 shows supply of high powered money. E is our initial equilibrium point. At this equilibrium point, you can see money supply is OM. Now, suppose demand is constant, only increase in supply of high powered money. And our new high powered money supply curve is HS1. And our new equilibrium point is E1. At this equilibrium point, you can see as a supply of high powered money increase, our money supply also increase from M to M1. So we can say that as high powered money increase, then our money supply will also increase in economy. Now we are going to talk about money multiplier. As we know, money supply increase when high powered money increase. And money multiplier is a degree to which money supply expanded as a result of increase in high powered money. That means money multiplier basically measure how much money supply increase due to increase in high powered money. Now we will see formula of money multiplier. M equal to M over H. Here small m represent money multiplier. Capital M represent money supply, H represent high powered money. As we know money supply is equal to C plus D. C means currency with public, D means deposit in bank. So M is equal to C plus D and H is equal to C plus RR plus ER. H means high powered money. So in this equation we will put value of M and H. After putting value of M and H our equation will become like this. Uh, C plus D over C plus RR plus ER. Now we will divide upper and lower part with the D. After doing this, uh, our equation will become like this. This D and D cancel with each other and become equal to 1. For the sake of simplicity, we will write C over D as a CD. Again, C over D as a CD. RR over D as a RD. ER over D as a ED. So this is our final equation. With the help of this equation, we can know how much money has expanded through our monetary base, through our high powered money. As we know, expansion of bank deposit lead to expansion of money. Means, with the help of bank deposit, we can know how much money they have expanded in economy. 
इन दिस इक्वेशन सी डी रिप्रेजेंट रेशियो ऑफ करेंसी टू डिपोजिट मीन परसेंटेज ऑफ करेंसी इन डिपोजिट एंड आर डी रिप्रेजेंट रेशियो ऑफ रिक्वायर्ड रिजर्व टू डिपोजिट एंड ई डी रिप्रेजेंट रेशियो ऑफ एक्सेस रिजर्व टू डिपोजिट सो दिस इज ऑल अबाउट हाई फॉवर्ड मनी एंड मनी मल्टीप्लाई आई थिंक यू गोट इट एंड थैंक यू सो मच फॉर वॉचिंग दिस वीडियो बाई टेक केयर